and show people that he can actually be something in the NFL. And I'm excited for it. Now you have just that's just another freak of nature, a ton more speed to put on the outside, a big guy. He's more than likely going to be your ex until J-Mo comes back. I saw people like, I, I posted that, and I was like, can you imagine week seven, Jameson Williams and Denzel Mims on the outside, Sam Laporta and Amon Ross St. Brown over the middle, and Jameer Gibbs out of the backfield. Like, that's going to be nasty. And people were like, if you think he's getting snaps over Josh Reynolds and Marvin Jones Jr., you're high. Like, come on. All due respect, like, those aren't. You know, these big name guys that should immediately be getting snaps over him or, or should be ushered in just because they're already here like that. Would you rather have Marvin Jones Jr. out there or a guy that's six three with a four three? Like Yeah, I mean I, the, you, you can't point to the fact that like he hasn't really done much in his short career. It's, Zach it's, Wilson. it's only been two years, but there there you go. That's that's the part that you're missing. And and I know this has been touched on throughout the entire day here on the, the <coughs> network, but like one of the, I, I like the offense. I think part of the offense last year was the top three offenses because of a certain character name, DJ Chark. And DJ Chark was that same similar build, six foot four guy, ran a, went a fast forty, like four three, catch the ball deep. And I was butt hurt and sad when we lost him. Yeah. And then we grabbed Marvin Jones. Like it's, it's nice, but d- can he still be he's that? A little, he's a little old. Is he true X? We, we were missing that true X. Amaras, you know, slanted to play the the slot. We talked about uh, Ben Johnson the interview with 10, 20 minutes, and he's gonna play the slot too in terms mm-hmm. of Jamison Williams. And now you have a guy that could potentially be your true X. Now, that's where the people who wrote you in the tweets, or whatever, kind of have a point. But like, like you said, Zach Wilson was his quarterback. Uh, the the corpse of Joe Flacco was his quarterback. Freaking Mark Watt, Mark Watt, 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 his quarterback. Not only is like Jared Goff an upgrade over every single one of those names outside of playoff Joe Flacco, he also like Ben Johnson. Yes. 